Hey, uh, welcome to my YouTube channel. Um, I'm Aaron and I make art. I previously only posted TikToks, but I've always wanted to do YouTube, so uh, here we are. I have an Etsy shop um, where I sell pyrography or wood burning that I do every day. Um, I make them into wall hangings or signs or whatever you want to call them. Uh, I do them every day, so I figured why not film the process and upload it to YouTube? I'm not sure if that's all I'll post. Um, I'm sure I'll do a variety of things, um, but for now, that's what I'll do. I don't only do biography. I do things with all mediums, but I do this the most because it's unique and I think it's fun. And I hope people enjoy watching, I guess. Um, those are some examples of what I do. Um, here's Batman, a silhouette of Batman. Uh, Silhouettes are pretty simple to do, uh, that's why I like doing them, because they're easy and they look cool. Um, it's like a little piece of wood, I use um, pallets, actually like old pallets, and I cut them into size and I sand them and then I do my artwork on them. Uh, it's a free source of material, so it works out. Um, Here's another piece, Spider-Man. I know another superhero. I just happened to do two superheroes in a row for my last two projects. I, I guess um, I got inspiration from the new movies that came out, I guess. <laughs> um, yeah, so once I kind of learned how to do pyrography better, I started doing more detailed pieces like this. Um, just having to learn how the tools work and everything and uh just how everything works really um because it is a lot different than anything else in art to be honest it's like just learning something completely different than anything else um i'll show you this one these few are my favorite i like space um so i did this one a little astronaut floating um yeah, so this is another, like, it's not a silhouette, but it's basically all one shade. I just kind of, uh, just put a little lighter shading on him just to not make him look like a, a Michelin Man or whatever. Um, you know, last not floating, I thought it was pretty neat to have the word floating, floating, you know, it's so funny. Um, actually, I put that over here. And I have this one. This is just kind of like a um, a take on uh, like industry overtaking nature type thing. So I just made a brick wall and then put a tree inside of it. Um, this actually took like forever to do to get all these individual bricks colored in because I mean it's basically the entire piece of wood colored in. So it took a while because I had to go over it a couple times. And then I did this planet which came out looking like jupiter um didn't mean for it to i kind of just freehanded it and this is what it came out came out to um i used this dremel tool and i use the wood burning tool to do this um if people are interested in how like the specifics of how this stuff works i'll go into it but um that could be a separate video um, like it has different like tips to it and so does the Dremel. Um, I made these stars with this uh, tip actually just going making dots around so um, Yeah, so there's that one um, What I mainly like go for usually on my Etsy is like uh, Like things that can really be used as like home decor like this like just welcome sign that you can just hang on your door I use um like just this rope that I have, and then I use a like, heavy-duty stapler to staple it in the back so it stays. Um, pretty simple, but I think they're cool. I don't know. Um, if you're interested, you can go to my Etsy. Um, it's called Aaron's Treasure Art. Um, yeah. Here's another one. A little just beach life sign. Um, a little landscape. It can be difficult to get... Uh, 
detail with what burning because it um because you can only have so many different like colors and shades so um i try my best to like break up the layers here I'm kind of proud of this tree though i've never been good at making palm trees but that one came out pretty well um yeah so i make stuff like that um i have a bunch of little signs like i just I made like little random ones like this, like a little crow. Um, I think this is actually favorited by somebody on Etsy shop right now. So if you want to beat them to it, go buy it. Um, I'm not gonna like make every video into an ad or whatever to try to promote my Etsy shop. It's just, that's what I make these for. So I'll probably talk about it a lot. Um, like that color you just saw with the orange, I use these chalk markers. Um, you just push it down, and then the ink or paint comes to the front. And you gotta be careful not to drip too much, because if you drip too much, then it kind of rubs off. Um, and it's not very fun to try to get off your hands. So I don't use too much of the chalk markers, because um, they can be kind of messy sometimes. But if I need to add some color, I will. I also make stuff like this. Um, these, like, this artificial wood, uh, isn't the best, to be honest. It, it's a weird material. It's, like, nothing like actual wood. But, um, yeah, so here's a little sign to hang up, family. Um, yeah, the artificial wood, it's okay. But, um, I probably won't use it again, to be honest. If I want to make stuff like that, I'll just cut them into size myself. Um... Yeah, so on this channel, I will kind of just go through what I do every day and um, just film the process of me making the signs or whatever. Um, maybe do some, like, time lapses, because they, they can take a very long time. So do some time lapses. I know people think that those are uh, satisfying, which I do too, but um, we'll have to see how my editing skills are for that. Um, yeah, so that's basically what I do. Um, if, again, if people really want to know, like, the, um, ins and outs and how to actually do this, like, tutorials or whatever, I can, uh, I can definitely make a video on that, because I just use these two tools, but they come with a bunch of different tips and everything with different uses, and, um, it's kind of, um, a lot to just put in one intro video, so I can just make it into another video. Um, yeah, so if you're interested in learning how all this works and what I do and seeing more of my art, then keep watching my videos. I'll try to upload as consistently as I can. Um, never done this before, so just going to give it a go and see how it works. Um, peace.